Beijing has accused Manila of provoking tensions in the South China Sea after Philippine President Ferdinand Marcos upped the stakes in their row, vowing countermeasures against attacks by Chinese Coast Guard. China insists that the Philippines has been distorting the truth. China's Ministry of National Defense claims that U.S. intervention is the biggest driver of unrest in the South China Sea. They warned that military cooperation between Washington and Manila must not undermine Beijing's territorial sovereignty. President Marcos posted on Facebook that he doesn't see conflict with any nation, but stressed that his country would not be, quote, cowed into silence by Beijing. He said that his defense officials have been in communication with international bodies who've offered to help the Philippines in protecting its sovereignty. Vietnam has expressed deep concern over recent upticks in tension in the disputed South China Sea. It's calling on both China and the Philippines to respect each other's sovereignty and added that it has historical evidence and legal foundations to assert its own claims in the waters. The Philippines and China have frequently engaged in a standoff around the contested Second Thomas Shoal. Last weekend, Chinese vessels blocked and fired a water cannon at a Philippine civilian boat, which was on a resupply mission to a grounded warship there. The incident left the vessel damaged and three Filipino crew members on board wounded.